Hello guys, welcome back to the news, my country people. The ABC presidential campaign council, don't us say Peter Obi's court case against Tinibu is a joke of the century. Guys, I sincerely believe that if Bola Tinibu has nothing to hide, if he is sincere to himself and to Nigerians at large that he became the president-elect of this country through the votes of Nigerians, through the electorate vote, then he has nothing to be scared of. Even his spokesman should have nothing to be scared of because they know that at last the truth would eventually reveal itself. But then we have the director of special media projects and operations of Bola Tinibu and Kasim Shatima Presidential Campaign Council, PCC, Femi Fani Kayode, has hit out at P2B and the Labour Party after P2B filed a court petition challenging the outcome of the last month's disputed presidential election that was won by the ruling All Progressive Congress, APC. The Labour Party said they are challenging Tinibu's qualifications and the electoral process, but Fanny Kayode said the Labour Party's legal battle against his party is going nowhere. As for your court case, you, you are challenging Ashiweju. In fact, this is the joke of the century. It is going, it is not going anywhere. You will come out crying. We shall spank you hard there and flush you down the toilet, just as we've done in all the elections. The message is simple and clear. Politics is for big boys and not for the misguided the rude, the vain, and the dislogged. The former aviation minister wrote on his verified Twitter handle on Wednesday night. Guys, this is coming from no other person than Femi Fani Kayode, the campaign spokesman of uh, Bolad Metinibu and Kasim Shatima. This is really serious. So, in don't us say, come, Opito B, let me tell you, your court case is going nowhere. In fact, this is the greatest joke of all century. You are coming out claiming you are dragging Tinibu to court. Meanwhile, you know within yourself that your case is not going anywhere. This is how we've been doing the elections and nothing will change it. This is the joke of the century. And last, last, you will come out crying. Femi Fani Kayode tells Pito B. And even the obedient. Fanny Kayode mocked Peter B, mocked the Labour Party for their inability to even win any state in the governorship elections. He said, ooh, shame on you, shame on you, look at you. You call yourself Labour Party. You call yourself Obi followers. Meanwhile, you've not even won any state. You couldn't win any state in this governorship elections. And yet you feel that you can wake up one morning and feel a petition against my principle. You feel you can wake up one morning and drag a Bolatinibu to court. See, let me tell you, leave politics alone. Politics is for big boys and not for small boys like you. He referred to Peter B as a small boy. He said, leave politics alone. The big boys are the likes of uh, Jagaban, the Jagaban of Lagos. He knows politics more than you. Peter B, all this charade that you are going around displaying is just a waste of time. In fact, this is the greatest joke of the century. And you know within yourself that you will be defeated. Yes, you will be defeated because this court case is not going anywhere. Guys, this Femi Kayode is really trying to tell us something. Oh, let's look deeply into the meaning of this his statement, of this statement he has just made. Because what he has said is, Peter B's case is not going anywhere. So does that mean that the court has been compromised already by the APC? Is that what Fanny Kayode is trying to tell us? That the court and the judicial system has already been compromised by the ruling All Progressive Congress. So all Peter B's court petitions that he has been filing against Tinibu, is that what is he trying to tell us that all has been in vain? Is that what he, 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 he's, he, he's trying to tell us? That uh, look at uh, Peter B, who lost the presidential election, who even came out third position. 
Yet, he insisted that he won the election. Come, see, let me tell you. It's best you just drop this your case. Because there's nothing, nothing will happen. Yes, you that have not been able to win any state in the governorship election. But yet, you come out and you feel that you can defeat my principle. You feel you can challenge Bola Metinibu in court. This is the joke of the century. Guys, I sincerely believe that Femi Fani Kayode should drop his statement because it is not leading us anywhere at all. He is just, he, he, he is fond of coming online, saying all sort of, you know, statements against one person or the other. I sincerely don't know where this hateful sentiment and spite, I don't know where it's coming out from. For a whole Femi Kayode, tomorrow you will see him. He will run back to PDP. Tomorrow now, when all is not well with APC again, maybe when PDP comes back to power or when any other political party comes back to power, you will see Femi Kayode. He will run back to the ruling party. You know, say, Femi Kayode is a politician. He's a politician that believes in now where the left face, now there will they go. Now where we see food chop, now, now the person with they clap, now the person with they dance, they give. You know, Obasan Joe has said, see, Femi Kayode is my boy. I know him very well. Just give him food. He will sing, he will clap, and he will dance for you. That is what he is doing now, at this very moment. You understand? That is what he is doing. So, he even sent a message to the obedience. He said, see, let me tell you, despite all your initial gragra, all the old media gragra, what well, I don't do, what well, I don't carry body, when I don't carry shoulder, say yes, when I go win the election, after the noise, after the insult, yet you couldn't win one state in the federation. You are still even struggling to claim Abia, which I hope you will win. Least you will commit suicide. Chai. Looks like your crazy delusions and white dreams have been shattered forever. Yet, instead of you to focus on your future, you are here obsessing about Lagos. See, let me tell you, there's no hope for you guys. There's no hope for the Labour Party. Guys, Femi Kayode is always fond of making, you know, some funny, funny statements on his Twitter page. He's always tweeting one thing or the other, my country people. This is really serious indeed. So Femi Kayode have stated that P2B will cry at last. That he should just drop this case now before it is too late. So guys, what are your thoughts concerning this issue? I'm dropping here guys. Kindly share your thoughts concerning this in the comment section down below. Thank you. Bye for now.